made the trek into the new hotel. Today I'm staying in the Paradise Cove Hotel. It is the winner of 2012 Traveler's Choice Award. What's so great about this place? You're about to find out. Oh my god! This room is so huge! I really love the colors here. It's with a combination of orange with hot pinks and the green color. Oh my god! I can spend my whole day here. I'm pretty sure the whole concept of the room is based on the dedication of love. And I really like the bed lights against the future background with the white mirror to widen the perspective. And I really like the drapes hanging on the ceiling. Russia is famous for several world class items. If the seemingly long miles of beaches can seem to satisfy you, then you should learn this. Go for spa. And at Paradise Cove Hotel and Spa, they specialize in a spa treatment called the Science Mode. So let's check it out. The Flower and Bath was one of the spa treatments that I always wanted to try as I think it's a great way to pamper myself. It was calming for my tired body and soul after running on the road whereas the Ayurvedic massage relaxes my speech muscles. After staying in so many resorts in Mauritius, this is the first time I'm entering into the hotel's kitchen. Come on, the chef is waiting for me. One of my most favorite food in Mauritius is the red snapper fish cooked by Chef AJ. It is perhaps the most delicious dish I tried in Mauritius. As you can see, the fish is so fresh and juicy in a solid piece instead of a flabby, lifeless form. This is one of the love nests that's scattered around the hotel with a panoramic view over the ocean and five islets on the northern coast of Mauritius. Love nest actually means a meeting place for lovers. Imagine coming here with my loved one, talking heart to heart. That ought to be really sweet. But I should stop dreaming. I'm all alone here. Once I stepped into this hotel, it gave me such a brand new experience. I felt as if I stepped into an Indian palace where the Maharajas were staying. It's a boutique hotel, so the rooms are extremely fancy with different themes of decorations, mostly with Indian atmosphere subtly brightened up with very warm colors. The only word that I can find to describe the atmosphere of the room is the word sexy. 